Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich from the International Space Station. Uh, every time we eat it's kind of fun. Uh, everything will float around if you don't manage it. So we have some tape to stick things on on our table here. But we have tortillas. So we use tortillas a lot for uh, sandwiches. I'm going to stick that down to some tape here so it doesn't go floating away while I'm getting everything else ready. So I'll get my peanut butter out. I'll scoop out some peanut butter for my sandwich. I'll spread the peanut butter on my sandwich and then I'll get my jelly ready and you just spread the jelly on the sandwich. So there's my peanut butter and jelly tortilla or sandwich and enjoy. Let's see if you guys can enjoy it as it's coming to you. Let's see, to get started these are the things I need. A bag of warm water, a little no rinse shampoo, towel and my comb. What I like to do is start by just putting some hot water, squirting it onto my scalp. Sometimes the water gets away from you and you try and catch as much as you can. Then I just work the water up through to the ends of my hair. Then I take my no rinse shampoo and squirt it also on the scalp, just a little bit and rub it in. Again, kind of working it out to the ends. And I like to take my towel while I have the shampoo in there and just kind of work it. Because without standing under running water, you kind of need to use the towel a little bit to help get some of the dirt out. I like to follow that by a little more water. It actually feels kind of squeaky clean right now. I take the dry part of my towel we use towels for quite a while here since we have limited supplies. At the end, I just do one final comb through to make sure there are no snarls and snags. And that is how I wash my hair in space on the International Space Station. First of all, the desire to go, the need to go, to go is very similar as on Earth. Where you just know you have to go. And we have the toilet, which consists of a seat and a metal bucket. The urine goes into this hose right here. This knob right here activates the whole system. You take the valve and uh, Turn it on, you hear the fan noise, check for airflow, we've got our uh, simulator, and that's where your business goes. You're complete. You want to be a good crew member, so you make sure that you wipe off the excess. Okay, when it is time to go, you flip this lever here, and that lifts up the lid. The seat here is about, oh, five or six inches in diameter, and there's a, a plastic liner in there, which where your deposit goes. What I have here is green beans and mushrooms, and I do not like mushrooms, so I don't mind contributing this piece of uh, food in the name of education. So pretend I ate this yesterday, and now it goes into there. You clean yourself, and the wipes go into there as well. You take this red tab, you pull it off the rim, and depends on how full the container is. This one's about halfway through. We do have a, a stick, and you push it down in there with all its other friends, and then it's time to put a new bag on. And 
ready to go. Close it up. What we have is a sleeping bag and we have that up against one of the walls and it's strapped to one of the walls so that you can kind of keep yourself in position. I would zip myself in the sleeping bag and I also had a little belt that I wrapped around the middle and I could put my arms down and try to keep them down sometimes. Sometimes I actually slept with my arms up over my head like that. 